What is up ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to Fudge Mop and it's Scott here with another Is It Worth It video all about something a little bit different today, the Stealth Boy mod for your power armor. Now this goes on the chest piece and it requires science 4 to achieve. Now in a nice little concise pre-sentence before I ramble on for a minute, I really don't think it's that worth it, especially when there are other things like reactive plates or the jetpack, and especially if you are only sort of getting four out of four science just to get the stealth boy for the power armor. If you're a stealth character, you sort of don't want to be wearing big chunky armor, especially if you're anywhere sort of in close range. And I mean, the stealth boy helps and you can stealth around fine in power armor with all of the sneak perks, but then again, it's, you just may as well not be in power armor because you have a better advantage. You're less noisy and you don't even need all of that power armor because you're not supposed to be found as a stealth character, so you're never really going to get hit enough to sort of warrant it. And you can also get legendary items with the same chameleon effect because the stealth boy only becomes active when crouched and still. However, there is one sort of character that I think this works fairly well for, and that's a sniper. So if you're some big heavy power armor sniper and the noise from your power armor isn't really gonna affect you because you're always at such a long distance and then your stealth boy crouch and you go invisible and you're sniping from a distance, that works out pretty well. But then again, it's not the most necessary thing. You could get the same effect from chameleon items and you do need science for to get this, so you need to have a relatively intelligent character to do this, six intelligence. Personally, I would recommend the science perk because of a whole other lot of reasons, not specifically for the stealth boy. So overall, in my opinion, it's not worth it, but it's fine. You can easily use it for a sniper type character. You can use it for close range stealth though. It's just not as good as when you're outside of the power armor. And of course, there are better mod alternatives, even things like the medic pump or reactive plates or jetpack or Tesla coils. There's a lot of other stuff that I personally think suits power armor better. So ultimately, I don't think you should really go for this mod. But of course, if you have multiple suits of power armor and you have a stealth suit of power armor that you want to run around with every now and then, that's fine. It works okay for sniping. The whole thing works. It's just not as effective as normal sneaking because of the noise from the power armor, so you may as well just do normal sneaking since the goal is to remain undetected when you are sneaking and trying to get sneak attacks rather than sneaking around in what essentially is a walking armored tank. Anyways, I hope that covered it all for you guys. Leave your comments and thoughts and opinions down below and we can create a little discussion. But overall, in my opinion, it is not worth it because there are so many better alternatives and there are better ways to sneak. So anyway, subscribe for more Fallout 4 videos and builds and worth it videos. And guys, I will see you next time and have a good week.